The governor said, looking at the statistics, Nigeria appears to be a middle-income country, but going across the statistics in terms of human development indicators, northern Nigeria is the less educated and unhealthy region. He added that people of his age ought not to be in leadership if youth will unite to assume their rightful place. So our strategy is simple. If you take really smart, committed and competent young people and give them the opportunity, it will encourage other young people to know that government is not just for old people. Government is not just for corrupt people. Government can be for everyone, particularly young, smart people that want to make a difference. And we have many of them in the Kaduna State Government and I'm very proud of what they have achieved in the last Four years. The convener of the program, Aisha Faliki, urged you to work harder and learn new skills that will make them self reliance. She also called on the government at all levels to support youth with aim of reducing unemployment in northern Nigeria. We need to awaken because there's so much poverty in the land. We can't just sit down and say, oh, our government is going to do this, or our government, there's no job. People are graduating, no, no, no jobs. So we have to do skill acquisitions. Um, we have to use our hands to make money so that we can eat. And that's just the basic thing. On her part, the wife of Kaduna State Governor Aisha Ummi Erufai expressed concern over the increased rate of youth violence, especially in northern Nigeria. Ummi said there should be innovative approaches such as promoting entrepreneurship and skills development in diverse fields to endeavor among teeming youth population. So it's necessary to support this because our youth need to um, realize their potential. They need to realize the need for them to be economically and financially empowered so that they can take the reins of leadership. Leadership should not be something we should jump into as a career. It is something we should go into when we're financially comfortable. The Northern Youth Summit organized by Northern Habiscus Initiative in Kaduna has in attendance the member house of representative representing Iru and Bebeji Federal Constituency, Abdul Mu'min Jibril, and others across all walk of life. Abu Bakr Sadiq Galadima, Liberty News.